Hello there, YouTube. This is Kurt. We're going to take a look at Black Wings today, and they're going to get some upcoming support here, particularly these three cards. We're going to look at Suthri, we're going to look at Vada, and we're going to look at Shamal, well, another one. We have Chinook, and we have Blackfeather Whirlwind. These are some amazing, well, they're going to get, provide some much needed extension in order to go into some very unique plays for this deck and I don't have this deck figured out yet that's one thing I don't think the max potential has been found for this yet um, these could be a lot of filler down here but I'm seeing exactly how much we can do to extend our plays here uh, so there's a lot you can do here uh, hat tracker can be some much needed extents for the deck um, I would probably play this no matter what uh, these I'm actually trying to do a spicy play with dark rage dragon there's actually a lot of potential there, in my personal opinion, uh, because, well, A, it's a dragon, uh, just like just like we have Black Wing Assault Dragon, uh, oh wait, not that one, we have uh, Black Wing Dragon, excuse me, which also can be used as material to go into Hot Red, assuming you can have access to a Roshi, uh, which can be done pretty easily on a lot of hands. I really just had to figure out the consistency part of it. I think maybe Whirlwind might be a three. I'm not entirely sure about that, but obviously there is a really high ceiling here, and I think there is a lot of potential with this deck. So we're going to go through a sample replay here. Uh, this is obviously a really good opening hand, because anytime you open uh, some moon, some moon and an extender, normally you're going to be doing pretty well, and this will get you, make sure you pretty much always have access to Whirlwind. Uh, let's see what we can do with this um my standard combo right now if i'm taking advantage of the extra s sauce and the extra spice um you're going to go into black feather dark rage which isn't really on, on anybody's radar but we're trying to do a lot with it right now at least i am um so the normal black wing combos what, from what i understand if they don't get interrupted early on you're probably golden because if they want to use Ash Blossom or Imperm, there are great targets to use it. Vada is probably a really good target to use Imperm on. And uh, using uh, using Ash Blossom probably works really well, um, well on Vada too, because you're probably going to do that. Uh, this is going to be one of your main combo starters. So if you can get through all of that, the going for extra extension probably is going to be a pretty safe play. Just my personal opinion. All right. So this is pretty much what I've defaulted in going to. Vada is going to be your main combo. Um, I didn't, in this combo, I added, yeah, I add, oops, sorry, I want to pause there. Uh, I wanted to add, I didn't want to add Harmatin. Um, normally under this play, I want to add either Vata or a Roshi. I don't want to add that because this will be sent to the graveyard uh, to, along with, your burn guy. Uh, I forget his name. Uh, Zephyros. Zephyros. So, but this time we're just going to go ahead and use the extension. Uh, we're going to go into our uh, Black Wing Dragon and what we're going to send, we're going to send these two and Zephyros will be there. This guy is alright. I thought about cutting this guy, but it is a nice hand trap if you go first that you can uh, essentially add for another interruption. And we're going to summon... Yeah, we're going to sum back to level 4. We're going to get this back in hand for not really any particular reason. We're going to make the this a level 3. Now, uh, using this, we could also use Harmatin and summon that on the field afterwards to make sure we get into our Synchro level 8, but we're just going to find a different way into that Synchro level 8 this time. We have Steam the Cloak. Steam the Cloak is going to give us that level 4. We're going to get Rusty. And then Steam the Cloak is going to get the level 1. We're going to go into a Roshi. Now, through 3 materials, we have Dark Rage Dragon. Now we can potentially get some extension. A lot of people might think this is unnecessary to extend into, but it's important to understand that Whirlwind is not a once per turn. So there's a lot of, uh, just a ton of extension capability here. So now we can use Dark Rage to get five. We're only going to get one mill off of that, but that's okay. That really helps us out. So here we can <laughs> go into uh, Redoer, which is a really good play. And we have uh, Borlo Savage, and we're going to get another extensioner, extender off of that, which allows us to go into Hot Red. All right. 
So this can potentially represent an interruption. This board does, pr this actually does not lose to Dark Ruler because you can essentially chain to Dark Ruler. You can chain uh, Fog Blade. You can chain Fog Blade to the Dark Ruler, and then chain. Um, you can target Hot Red, but then Hot Red can target the Dark Ruler to make sure it's negated until the end of the turn. So you still have a lot of potential plays here. You also have a potential play, and if you have enough extension to go into uh, Rank 4 Evil Swarm Nightmare, which is also incredible interruption in the form of flipping face down your opponent's special summon monsters. We're going to take one more look at that here. Yes, I, I decided to put this in the extra deck because it's very good. There's just a lot of options here because being in the locked into the darks isn't uh, actually that bad. But yeah, the fact that this can represent two interruptions, uh, this canvas timing, the, uh, <laughs> keep in mind, uh, is actually really, really good. Uh, I'm going to cut this because I'm, I'm cutting the nightmare package, but uh, there's a lot you can do with this deck. Hopefully this brings up some ideas for you guys, and I think this deck actually might be more viable than people think it'll be. I don't think it'll be meta by any means, but this is powerful enough. Anything powerful enough to win some locals is powerful enough for me and to have fun with. Alright, that's all I got, guys. Peace out.